Hello and welcome to Hoff Pop, Hofstra's points of pride. I'm your host, Julia Wachtel. Michael Palin once said, geography explains the past, illuminates the present, and prepares us for the future. The faculty of Hofstra's fast-growing Department of Global Studies and Geography would agree. The department has recently introduced a new Bachelor's of Science in Geographic Information Systems, a discipline that teaches students how to analyze and present geographical data in order to solve spatial problems. We sat down with Dr. Craig Dalton, a professor in the department, as well as two students to find out just what makes this new program so unique. Dynamic, collaborative, empowering, critical thinking, going to make a difference in the world. The philosophy of the Department of Global Studies and Geography is empowerment through education. I am Craig Dalton. I am an assistant professor in Global Studies and Geography, specializing in GIS. GIS stands for Geographic Information Systems, which is a big, fancy, technical way of saying computer-based mapping and spatial analysis. We use this sort of thing for everything from traffic planning, ambulance response times, to environmental questions, how we can build a better, more sustainable, nice place to live in, whether that's Hampstead, New York, or New York City, or the Earth. Everybody does some kind of geography, right? Uh, even if it's just navigating to the classroom or going down to Target or something like that. And because of that, we have people coming in from all sorts of different fields. So I came into Hofstra. I'm in the 4 plus 4 BSMD program. Uh, I never ever thought that I would go into geography or for that matter GIS. I took a class with Professor Doubleday and I, he introduced me to the geography department and I took my first GIS class and I fell in love with it. I think that what makes the department special is the having a combination and having a set of programs that allows students to take the lead. We really make an effort to have projects, papers in the, in the department where students choose a topic that they work on and can pr pursue it so that it means that whatever they're working on are directly pertinent to the things that they find interesting and to the things that they find uh, professionally useful. One past project that I've done was mapping national parks in Long Island. It like showed me how to collect data and then analyze it and sift things out because there is a lot of data. And then the one I'm working on right now is migration to and fro the Caribbean, which is really interesting and I'm very excited about it. In the past here at Hofstra, I've worked with students and we've made a gender inclusive restroom map of campus so anyone of any gender identity can find a safe place to use the restroom. Uh, right now we're working on a data set of uh, disability access. I'm constantly looking for good, useful projects, either at Hofstra or the communities around Hofstra or New York at large, uh, because I, I, I have tools, I teach methods, uh, but I'm always looking for good cases to engage them. Right now they have this new technology coming out where they're trying to map out disease in the body, so being able to use GIS to like map out cancer so that you can create individualized therapy would be super cool, and also looking at it from more of a global health perspective, I think is where I want to take GIS. The underlying idea in global studies in geography and in my classes is teaching the kinds of critical thinking skills that are going to be important throughout someone's life and career. The ability to continue to ask questions depending on how social conditions, technologies change. The more that we know about those, and the more that we are able to respond to those, the better that we and everybody is going to be able to live on this increasingly small planet. Well, thank you so much for joining us. We truly hope you've enjoyed learning all about today's points of pride. To watch more episodes of Hoff Pop, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'm Julia Wachtel. Have a great day.